Alright pups, your guitar sage here. Today we're going to learn how to play Free Fallen by uh, Tom Petty. And I think John Mayer recently covered this too, if I recall. I think I came across that on YouTube. So, um, Alright, so, but we're going to be learning the Tom Petty one. So I don't know if, if John's playing it differently or not. But here we go. This is how we're doing it. And um, you just need to know a D, a G, and an A. Okay? We'll talk about the specific techniques and all that stuff in just one moment, okay? I'm going to go ahead and play it and then show you how to do it. Okay, here we go. I'm looking at my chart over here on my screen, and it's going to go something like this. By the way, any of the techniques that I'm talking about here today, if you don't get it, check out yourguitarstage.com. You can also um, get your hands on this chart here that I just did for this tune. Uh, it's real simple, but it's going to go something like this. Um, the chords are D, and of course the D here that I'm grabbing is muting that low um, sixth string. If you're wondering what that rattling is in the background, it's my cat. She's fixing to come in here, probably jump on me. Um, all right, so a D chord, um, and the D is is with a um, is with a low. My cat is scratching my knee right now. I apologize. Um, okay, the D is muting this low sixth string. Okay, and um, and then we got a G. Okay, here's my cat. It's Chupy. Say hey, Chupy. Um, then we got a G. Okay. The way I play my G is a lot of a lot of you will, will write to me and say, what are you doing with your G? You're a freak. And I say, yeah, I'm a freak, and here's how I play my G. Um, you can play it like this, it's fine. But I lift my first finger up, and I, and I um, put my uh, second finger here, and I mute that fifth string, okay? And that's how I play my G, okay? Um, okay, so there's my D, my G, my G, D. The A is going to be like, um, well, I take my, really, okay, really, I'm in a video here, cat, right? My, um, okay, two, three, and four, fingers two, three, and four are going to be right there on that A, okay? And this is how you're going to count this, okay? This song is in four, so it's like one, two, and four, one, and, and. One, two, and, 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 okay? Those are your hits. You're, hitting, you're, you're doing anticipations on the and, so it's going to go one, two, and. So it's on an upbeat. One, two, and, three, four, one, and, two, four, one, two, and, three, four, one. Okay, so that takes a little getting used to, and most people will strum this, they're going to do an all down strums, like, okay, but you could do, all right, or, okay, so, there's a few different ways to play this one. For those of you that are just starting off strumming, this may not be the best tune for you because it's a little bit confusing, but for the most part, that's the whole song, guys. All right, if you have any questions, check out yourguitarsage.com. There's a great informative ebook there that um, is basically a, um, a manual for some of my other videos that I'm doing on strumming and music theory and all that good stuff. So check out those other videos as well. Keep stopping by. I'm trying to put a video up, a video up every day, all right? Alright kids, get out of here, go practice, see ya.